Right everyone, Hamul Stapo and welcome back. Today I'm at Kuapo Market. Kiapo Market, not really sure how you say it. Anyways, as you can see, you've got the beautiful church behind me. Uh, I'm here to get my fortune told. I want to know about my love life and my fortunes. Am I gonna be rich? And am I gonna get married? Am I gonna be famous, baby? I don't know. So anyway, I found the fortune tellers, they're just over here. So let's check it out. Fortune teller, look at this. Card reading, lucky charms, wishing candle, boyfriend, girlfriend. Hello, sir. How, mu how much is it? Uh -huh. How much? 200. 200, yeah? Okay. Okay. Okay, yep. Yeah. I'm ready. Jump over me. Right hand? No, no, no. Uh, your birthday, please. So I'm just getting my birthday uh, written down. So that was a Tuesday. Yeah. I already know my, my day of birth. It was a Tuesday, I believe. I'm like the rain man, you see? Yeah. <laughs> so he's got a little, he's got a crystal ball here as well. Yes. Are you a black bird? Yeah, yeah. Uh, what is your content for your black? What is my intent? Content. Content. Oh, content. Travel content. Ah. Yeah, just travel content. Wow, this is really interesting, though. I like your bandana. Yes. Yeah, it's cool. It's like Karate Kid. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, sir, good afternoon. Yeah. Yep. My name is Lawrence Pinar. Lawrence, yeah. I am a gifted psychic since 1978. Yeah. Well, based on my analysis, mm -hmm. and your lucky day is Tuesday. Yeah. Tuesday is the day that you was born. Yeah. And you are under the Archangels of San Rafael. Right. And based to my assessment, uh, you was born under the year of the tiger. In, right. Yeah. Okay. And for those people born in the year of the tiger, uh, you are in a poor year. So that you need to be very, very careful to mm. all your under undertaking. And, uh, and also uh, be careful in terms of your financial management. Okay. But sometimes uh, when it comes to your financial management, that is your problem. But anyway, money is not your problem based on my assessment. Yeah. But uh, according to these cards, money is not your problem. But the problem on this is about how can you manage your money. Okay, yeah. Okay, and now uh, let's proceed to our tarot card reading. Okay. And this is uh, for you. Okay, thank you. Okay, I just want to tell you that about yeah. uh, do not defend on hula. It is only a guide to our everyday life. Yeah. But only God knows everything about what happened to our life. Okay. Right? Yeah. And your success and your fa and your failure is your own doing. Okay. Okay, get six cards. Six cards? Yeah. Okay. This one. Uh, this one. Um, is, that, is that three? Uh, four, five, and I'll go for the top one. Six. Six. Okay. Okay. Our second portion yeah. of our consultation is about the tarot card reading. So I just want to read your cards, okay. which is based on these cards. Um, you need to be very, very careful mm -hmm. in every word that proceeded out on your mouth. Yeah. And you are a person, a uh, good or bad, secrets to be revealed. Mm -hmm. this, uh, this, uh, this, this is what your card says. And um, according to this, sometimes you are so very jealous. Uh, you, you are jealous, right. and based on this card, uh, be careful 
to your relationship. Because someday you can be a part, uh, as I mentioned, that someday you can be a part of a third party relationship. Mm -hmm. So that you need to be very, very careful when it comes to your relationship. And do not love more than one. Yeah. Uh, do not love more than one because. Uh, if you love uh, more than one, just uh, lovers, uh, based on this card says that you cannot serve the two masters at the same time, so that you can only love only one. Okay. Based on this card, uh, you are experiencing this year the arguments or battles around you, which is about to your friend, something like that or other any problem any trial that comes into your life based on this card uh, speedy news or teach us uh, speedy news or situations coming into your life i think that they uh, this card uh tells that this card to you uh the speedy news uh, mentioned in this card is uh, I think that it's all about to your love life. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. You have the inner strength, and I think that you are suffering from uncontinuous success this year or until early next year. And based on this, be careful, and you need to prepare yourself for the confrontation in yourself or other people. Mm -hmm. So that you have to be prepared yourself because there's a confrontation happened to your life this year. Based on these cards, you have a uh, peace and harmony, but needing to take your blindfold off. Just like this, you have a blindfold on your eyes. Yeah. So that needing to to remove it and you look forward to your to your life path that's why because based on this card you need also to reassess all situations coming in your life mm -hmm. because you are so very uh, friendly very honest and very hard work too and there are so many people that love you just uh, just for example to your friends Okay, based on this card, kumbaga, highest cards on the dark card is just like this. Yeah. Uh, based on your, to your card set, you are so very powerful. You can manage all the people. There are so many people who love your work. There are so many people that uh, love, love your, uh, the way how can you communicate with them. You are a very respectable person. Get, get five cards. How many? Five. Five? Yeah. Okay. One, six, this is also the continuation of our tarot card reading. Yep. Between continuation of our tarot card reading, second set of cards. Based on these cards, all that glitters is that gold for you. But all you have to do is you need to look forward. Why do you need to look forward? Because you have a lot of money improvements happen to your life starting today until early next year of 2023. Mm. Uh, money confusion and situation or ideas around. Meaning, someday when uh, something about the little problem about money, you feel that you are confused. But don't worry because there are so many people uh, besides you or you have a lot of friends that, that are willing to help you financially if you are suffering from money confusion. But based on this, 
you have a two stars and two stars are represents to your success and infinity just like this is represent to your never ending success mm -hmm. uh, based on this you have a, a basic good news from God when we say basic good news that particular good news that particular good news is for you and that is the uh, the gift of God to you you are experiencing movement of residents and that particular of movement of residents there is a victory over a situation or problem and you need to balance your opposite polarities okay, okay. Get three cards. Three? Yeah. Okay, uh, one. Two. Okay. Based on this card, justice. According to this card, based to this card, sa, that I interpret your card, yeah. uh, you need to consult a legal counsel yeah. to seek a legal advice regarding to that particular legal situation or document and based on this uh, on that particular document there is some correction okay just like your birth certificate for yeah. example yeah. there is a correction or that particular document so that you need to legal counsel uh, to seek a legal advice but that is not uh, that is not a big brother yeah. uh, problem but you need to consult your uh, no, your legal counsel based to this careful to all people besides you because there is a stabilizing negative influence that coming into your life so that you need to be very very careful and do not trust them so much mm -hmm. huh? as uh, i repeat that you doesn't need or you doesn't really need to trust them so much yeah just be careful always wherever you go and whatever you do based on this card there is a young woman here okay. she is your past uh, love life i think and she is uh, she loves you so much and she wants to come back with you again but the decision is yours and even me i did, i cannot decide for you because god almighty has given uh god almighty has given us the greatest gift which is the free will or the freedom of choice mm -hmm. okay. Do you have any question? Uh, no questions. Uh, okay, yeah. thank you very much. Yeah. And it's a great honor for me. Okay, thank you. Uh, okay, thank you very much. When do you uh, use the crystal ball? Just out of interest. Yeah. A crystal ball yeah. is using uh, to read your what is in your mind or in your heart. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. yeah let's use crystal ball. Okay. I really want to use this crystal ball, so yeah, let's do it. Just hold this crystal ball. Yeah. Uh, no, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. Based for what I see in crystal ball, there is an airplane coming up. And that airplane particularly you have more experience about traveling in over the, the whole world and someday you will receive your blessings or your success that given by God to you mm -hmm. and you need to continue whatever you do in your life and that is good and you, uh, you can help uh, more and more people especially to your country 
especially for the people who need your help. And based to this image, be, be careful to the robbery. Be what? To the robbery. Robbery. Oh, robbery. Okay. Robbery. Yeah. Be careful. And God has given you the great opportunity to travel all over the world because that is the will of your fortune. And that particular will of fortune is the greatest gift of God to you. So, and based on this card, uh, you need also extra careful in every decision yeah. come in your life. And also to all people beside you. Mm -hmm. Because you are a good man, you, you are a good, a good person, but you need also uh, more prayer wherever you go. And based to this card, you can travel, you can travel more than two countries or you can travel all over the world so that that is the greatest gift of god to you yeah and i want and i will advise you that you need to uh you need to continue your for being a good heart okay and someday god give you the protection the prosperity the abundance and good luck starting today or until next year mm -hmm. okay thank you very much that okay. is the end of our review okay okay Can thank you thank you right guys so what did you think of the fortune teller what did you think of the cards that i picked what did you think about the crystal ball i've been told to be careful not to love two letters i don't even love one right so after that stressful encounter with the fortune teller telling me to be careful with the girls i'm starving so let's get some food mm. oh man that smells really nice i love noodles as well eggs mm. hey, what's up? <laughs> which one's the best uh, so tang on. So this one, right side there. Yeah. Oh, that one. <coughs> That's it. Yeah, sweet, okay. Got a seat already, excellent. So I'll keep this on my back. Save some room. I like the look of this one. Are you? Stuck. Lovely, thank you. Yeah, this one looks good. Yeah. What is that? Is that beef? What? Is that beef? Uh, what? Beef? Yeah. I think. Or is that beef? Beef. Beef. Yeah. Almost look like um like a kebab, mate. It looks really good. This is my first time here. How oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, it looks really good. But my friends. Your friends recommend this one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's put some garlic and chili. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, I love chili, so okay. vamp it up. What's this one? Pepper? Uh, black pepper. Oh, okay. A little bit on Excellent. There are British nationality? Yeah, yeah, from London, yeah. Man, it smells good. Is it good? You tried it? Yeah. You should try it. It looks so amazing. So tang hon. So tang hon. Right, let's put some chili on it. Let's make what it's about. Lots of chili, lots yeah. of crispy garlic. Spicy yeah. yeah, I love spicy food. That meat looks so nice. Mm. 
Right, let's try the broth. Yummy. Mmm, yeah, that is really nice. Mmm. Oh, wow. That is lovely. Are you from Manila? Yes. Yeah? Sandaan Manila. Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Wow, this meat is so good. It's like an English kebab mixed with noodles and a really good broth. Oh, man. That is a very sustainable meal. I give it to you. Oh, excellent. Thank you. Rice cake. Oh, thank you very much. It's very kind of you. Is that ube, is it? Yeah. Mm. So I just got a gift. Right. An ube rice cake. Excellent. Rice cake. Thank you very much. You're welcome. So Ronald here has paid for my cake. Very, very nice guy. Thank you, Ronald. Uh, thank you very much. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How was the food for you? Huh? How was the food? Yeah, great. Yeah, very, very, very good. good. Mm. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you, Ronald. Take okay. care, mate. Look at that. And it's free as well. It always tastes better when it's free, doesn't it? It's like an ube rice cake with chocolate on it. <laughs> okay, so I think it's got condensed milk, rice and chocolate and ube. Mm. Yeah, look at that. Absolutely stunning. Mm. Wow. Those noodles were absolutely delicious. And it's only one pound for a bowl. Basically like kebab meat, rice noodles or glass noodles, really good broth, vegetables. Very, very good. Hello. And yeah, what a good experience, just sitting down with the locals, eating that delicious food, met a new friend, Ronald, I never actually had met anyone called Ronald before, so that was cool. I wonder how many times a day he hears the word Ronald McDonald. Hello. Yeah, I wonder how many times people ask him his name, Ronald. He's like, yes, it's the same as Ronald McDonald. Anyway, guys. I'll uh, leave the video here because it's going to be a very long one. But, uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Take care, Mr. Man.